Hi everyone, it's David with BMP Press. Today we're going to go over how to use the native FTP client that is inside of Windows 7. So in other words, how to use FTP services without a third-party client such as FileZilla or CyberDuck. So the first thing we're going to do on our Windows 7 machine is go to Start, Computer. We're going to go back up here to Computer, get rid of the word Computer and get in here our server, which for us, of course, is uh, pppress.com. But first, you want to type ftp.ppress.com or ftp.example.com for whichever server you're using. Ours, of course, is ftp.ppress.com. So go ahead and click Return. We come up with this window, which we want to see. I know it sounds oxymoronic because it's an error. Uh, go ahead and we're all good go ahead and click OK here now notice in this area we've gone from the internet to ftp.pppress.com to this work area right here in the middle go ahead and right mouse click not left click right mouse click after doing that you get login as which is what you want of course now you can see our servers pppress.com we're going to go ahead and use our test username We'll send you your username and your password through another form of communication. And if you want to, you could go ahead and click Save Password. Go ahead and click Log In, excuse me, Log On. And go ahead and ignore this. This is just a system file. I went and gone ahead and made this file so you can see a file from us. Now, this is not on your computer, obviously because it says the internet FTP press excuse me ftp.pppress.com but you can take it and drag the file from us to your desktop and right here I have this pre-made file called a file from you so you would just take these files like your PDFs for us to print and just whoop copy it right there it gives you the progress and you're done it's that easy this has been how to use FTP services without a third-party client. We're looking forward to working with you. Thank you.